I'm going to show you guys how to make a custom Xbox 360 dashboard wallpaper. First, you guys want to go to this site. It's on DeviantArt. I'll have the link in my description. You'll notice there's a dashboard wallpaper for the widescreen. You want to save the image. And down here, there is a link for the standard template. For all of the, you that have the standard TV, you would save the template. And you go to your Photoshop, and I have the widescreen wallpaper. I'm going to go to the image size. You can see the width is 1920, height 1080. I found this picture on Google. Thought I'd use it. Made the width 1960. I'm going to select it all, and copy it, paste it into my template. Now I'm just going to move it up a little bit. Alright, I have this picture of myself that I'm going to be using, but there is a silhouette that I want to use of it so I'm just gonna use this and drag it over to the picture that I already have and I'll move it over here I don't really like it white so I'm gonna make it black and erase the extra stuff that's there Alright, now that I have that, I'm just going to go ahead and put my gamer tag on here. You can just pick out whatever font you want. I personally really like this one. Alright, I'm just going to put my name behind my silhouette. Looks better that way, I think. And I'll move my images and my text around a bit. Okay, I'm just gonna select my gamer tag and pick a color for it. Everybody knows I like orange, so. That's going to be the color I make it. Now I'm just going to go to the blending options and mess around with some of this stuff, figure out what I like best. I'm not sure exactly what I want.
Okay, I, I'm done with that, so I want to save the image. And I'll go to save as, and you want to make sure that you go to your My Pictures folder and put your picture in there. Uh, I put mine in Sample Pictures, and you save it as a JPEG file. Alright, you'll be at your dashboard and you go to My Xbox and Picture Library. If you have a USB device, you want to go to Portable Device and select your picture from your USB. Mine's on my PC. So I'll go to Shared Pictures. Then I'll go to Sample Pictures, which was the folder I put it in and my picture was cyanide so this is it and you'll see it says apply as background Y you push Y and say yes use this picture and there it is as my background I'll show you guys what it looks like and that's all there is to it